पागल हो क्या As I saw Dhruv Rathi critically analyze friends on the Netflix YouTube channel I came to the conclusion that any crossover or video idea is possible hence I went into a rabbit hole of trying to understand what is the fascinating world of Saath Nibana Saath here ha aise bhi the na gaye a show on Star Plus that went on for 7 years Yash Raj a musician who has created several parody songs made this show and its characters recently viral through his hilarious song then just like raven i had a vision 3 years ago when i spoke about gopi ma'am washing a laptop and hanging it like clothes to dry only for the husband to get a heart attack ki bhai kisse shaadi kar li hai this same show has seasons spanning 7 years and close to 2184 episodes what the hell is this even about how the hell did they prolong it for so long 2000 एपिसोड्स कैसे बना लिए इन्होंने द क्रिंज फेस्ट दैट इज साथ ने बाना साथ या फोकसेस ऑन टू कजन सिस्टर्स वन द इलिटरेट एंड नाइव गोपी एंड द अदर द कनिंग मैनिपुलेटिव एंड एजुकेटेड राशिद दैट गेट मैरिड इन द एफ्लुएंट मोदी फैमिली इन राजकोट व्हाट फॉलोज इज एनी सास बहु ड्रामा ऑफ कंटेंशियस इश्यूज लाइक वुमेन बीइंग फ्रेम्ड एज गोल्ड डिगर्स बर्गलर कंस्पिरेसीज एंड व्हाट इंडियन टीवी सीरियल्स आर नोन फॉर मेन मेक मनी एंड वुमेन बिकर एंड पुल ईच अदर्स हेयर इन द हाउस यू नो आई एम ट्राइंग टू अंडरस्टैंड हाउ अ शो like this can possibly have over 2100 episodes i wondered what are the plot points for episodes like the main twists motivations and actions of characters oh bye 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 it's another level of thinking when you explore that i literally did a relate with season 1 and selected random episodes to understand how the indian audience can stay hooked for so long Let's take into account season 1 episode 6. Rashi and her mother in their shady ways are trying to throw something in the trash. Gopi, raised by Rashi's parents, comes in the frame. Ki ye badbu bhai aa kahan se rahi hai? The aunt reprimands her ki badbu to aayegi na kyunki tum ghar saaf nahi kar rahe. Classic women pitted against women in the Indian serials. The woman drags both the adopted daughters to the kitchen and finds a notebook. She gives them a lecture saying padhai karne ka bahut bhoot sawar hai na. Again, classic Indian sanskar and burns the book. The family try to create an impression with the fluent family what is happening there a legend kokila ben is checking on the halwa and instructs her ki boss ye modi parivar ka halwa hai aur ghee dal aadhi bottle dal after shouting at everyone and tasting the paneer she interrogates kon laya ye paneer the family's meet one ostrak at the size of the mansion and kokila as usual irritated at their presence that's it <laughs> that's the episode i further uh, clicked on episode 10 randomly what can it be about Kokila the legend identifies that Gopi is the trustworthy candidate for her son while the villainous aunt and her cousin sister try to create an impression Rashi is tested on her cooking skills so she is told to make kheer and like master chef all the characters sit in a circle and judge ye baat alag hai ki wo shop se laaye hain but the sister knows pancham mithai ki kheer hai ye the girl after tasting the kheer says shit ye to maine jhoota kar diya why don't you make kheer in our kitchen as gopi does a talent show of her singing skills rashi struggles to cook gopi helps her cheat and then the invigilator comes to check but gopi bahut slick hai usne bas cockchit de di use sab phir dining table pe baith ke kheer chakte hain ye kya show hai and the moment you think that that's the only thing this episode is about gopi gets a compliment on her singing and she replies you are a fool expose 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 Gopi is illiterate. Kokila the legend is unfazed. Rashi sad. Episode over. What is happening? I randomly wanted to see whether maybe say if I skip 20 more episodes does it get any better? I checked out episode 38 when the two girls become the bahus of the Modi household. It actually gets worse. What's the plot point of this episode? Titled Gopi's illiteracy by the way. The rumor is that Gopi spent 5 lakhs for a jewelry set. The girl is blasted for her expensive ways and she takes the abuse, no one knowing that she is being framed. She was told that this was a gift by her husband, proof that there's a letter. But Gopi is illiterate, na? She doesn't know what's written and the camera mind numbingly just rotates as Ahem tells her to read the letter, not knowing that his wife is illiterate. The camera round and round, round and round, like chakki pissing and pissing, and you're like, "Hum kaha hain? Kyu hain?" Shocked at the fact that she is uneducated, a liberal, informed, and extremely woke man does as his best. Slap Gopi. Yeh yeh hamare sanskar.
you know, I sometimes wonder why our society is so restrictive with their outlook towards women and free thinking. And then you see the content that is so seeped into our subconscious that you wonder, no shit, we are the way we are. Urmila and Kokila in this episode go at it with each other. Kokila is all like, bitch, you're drinking Malai wali lassi. Kabhi socha bhi tha that you'll be so blessed. And she's like, Malai nahi, I'll pretend to be sick so that I stay here, bitch. And then Gopi comes to serve and Kokila instructs her, aaj malpua bhi banana hai. Urmila recognizes this, ki isse to rasode mein kaam karna hi padega. So let's handicap her by putting mehndi on her hands. Boom! But Kokila ain't having any lack of productivity in the kitchen. Haat saaf kar aur malpua bana. The cliffhanger of this episode, by the way, ends with ghee being put in the achar. Kokila ban has had enough of these incompetent bahus in the kitchen. Further, absolute gems in the series includes the much popular Yashraj parodied episode, Rasode mein kaun tha? Chane kisne nikale episode. Gopi being convinced of washing the laptop, of course, as if Gopi is the biggest imbecile you can think of. But here are some of the plot points of episodes. Rashi being responsible for the pressure cooker bursting. A mother-in-law as a punishment ties. Yes, ties the two daughter-in-laws together as they do household chores. Gopi's sari getting stuck in a table fan. One Bahu taking credit of putting oils in the Diyas for Navaratre. <laughs> Gopi being ridiculed for a lack of Dandya skills. Kokila Ben feeling humiliated because the Prasad isn't made with ghee. And in one episode, Gopi being locked up in a storeroom of the house for something she didn't do. The point I'm trying to make is, I understand that the whole Kokila Ben meme is hilarious and all fun and games, but it's so reflective of the regressive and sad mindset of what is being consumed in the name of content in our country. On what became an extremely popular show, and was primarily about women being horrible to one another regarding the most irrelevant and petty issues. I understand that the show is catered towards a particular demographic. I mean, it went on for seven years. The fact still remains that we have only retreated or worsened our content from what it was in the 90s, especially on TV. From aspirational driven young women, we will make 2000 episodes in the so that all the families who are watching this, they feel like this is the same. And this is okay. And that was the video guys. Write down in the comments below whether you have some video ideas for our channel. Please don't forget to follow me on Instagram. The handle is right in front of you. Follow me at jammypants4. Also please support us by smashing the like button and subscribing to our channel for weekly content ahead. Thank you for watching.